All right, people. So the straw polls are up. So this is from April to May. This is uh, number six. So uh, we've been rotating decks out on daily duels six times now, and uh, things are going well. So once again, we got another list of 30 both in. So I'm going to go ahead and introduce all the decks and uh, give my personal opinion on each of My personal opinion will sway you when it comes to decks that are on daily duels. So um, yeah, the link is in the description to both polls, single and tag. So single and uh, tag. So vote for the respective numbers. Vote for three for single and two for tag. And uh, next week we'll go ahead and see what decks are on, which decks are off, and which decks need deck profiles and which aren't. So starting off, of course, we have the decks that are currently on Daily Duel. So Buster Blader, uh, it's been on here for two months. I really don't need a third. I've got to just the deck and I've had my fun with it. Uh, Earthbound Monarchs, I, I would rather not have another month of that deck, but if you guys want to see another month of that deck, more power to you. Go ahead and go for it. Uh, Necros, that's another two months here. I, I'm good with it, so I wouldn't mind that leaving. Uh, Phantom Knights, pure Phantom Knights. No, none of that Burning Abyss, just pure Phantom Knights? Uh, sure, I wouldn't mind that. I mean, I kind of play Phantom Knights and, uh, uh, Phantom Ebel on the Vime Wild Ice Stream. Just playing it without having to hinder Ebel or work around Ebel, I think that'd be fun for, uh, entertainment's sake for Daily Duels. Herald of Perfection, I mean, uh, Venture Chart just went up to three, so, you know, if we want to go ahead and sack our opponent with Herald or Ultimate Herald, I mean, fuck it. Spellbooks. I don't like spellbooks, and if you guys want to vote for that, just to spite me, there you go. But I, I don't. I personally don't like spellbooks. I never did, even with judgment and even without judgment. I don't like spellbooks. They're boring to me. Uh, relinquished. All right. Maybe throwing a little bit of the Thousand Eye Restrict since it's uh, you know limited, and see what we can do with that. You know, even if like, even I mean I could just summon it with Inspiration. But maybe even attempt to summon it properly. I don't know. Maybe uh, Nordic. No, <laughs> that's just more for entertainment's sake, you know, you gotta keep in mind, uh, you guys can go ahead and state whatever deck, but you guys should probably keep in mind when it comes to entertainment's sake, you know, yeah, sure, you can go ahead and say Ice Barriers, but, I mean, are you really gonna watch me get my ass beat with Ice Barriers, come on, you know, uh, uh, Raid Raptors, uh, sure, I, I personally wouldn't mind Raid Raptors coming back for another month, I mean, it was a fun deck, so, it's really up to you, uh, PK Fire, sure, I mean, that would be Fender Knights with the power of Burning Abyss. All right, yeah. Uh, Metaphosis Yang Zing. I think that's probably one of the better versions of Yang Zings. So I totally wouldn't mind that, yeah. Uh, Rainbow Neos. I mean, I, I can try. I can try. That's all I can say. Evil Swarm. Yeah. I played my hand full of Evil Swarm. Like, that's Dirty Dan right there. So I guess. Uh, Chaos Dragons. That's another one, like, I guess. It would just be a Millie kind of jump you beater deck uh okay i guess hazy flames okay gadgets you see, you see we're starting to get to those decks so it's kind of like eh like uh, for the entertainment sake uh gear gear i mean with the with the new support you know uh uh the ocg exclusive cards are coming out in tcg as imports and uh uh shining victory so maybe we can do something with that i wouldn't mind that uh Clefort monarch all right it's a little bit different than um uh, Earthbound Monarch, where Cleefort actually have some synergy with the Monarch cards because they have the same stat. So uh, maybe play, figure out domain, work around a fill spell. I mean, uh, you know, we can do that. I have a tribute summon monster, and I just pendulum summon Cleefort out of the extra deck. Domain's ready to go. You know, so we could try that. We could try. It. I wouldn't mind that. Uh, Shiranui, sure. That, that's that's a powerful deck. I can definitely do something with that. Bes, I don't even know what that is. So I think it's those ship things. The the tributing machine. Chips? I don't know. I don't know. I guess. Uh, Evil Heroes. No. Salt Psychics. I don't know what that is. Uh, Naturia Monarchs. Uh, so, pretty much any deck that has a tributing mechanic, just throw the Monarch Engine on it. Is that how it works? Like, okay, I guess. Uh, Rock Stun. Okay. Uh, uh, Dark Magician. Okay. Uh, with Demok. Okay, so instead, we have to put Demok in. So I guess we've been playing Dedication and Best Sound to D-Mark. I mean, he got Unlimited. I mean, so we could probably do something like that. Uh, Resonators for singles instead of tag. That's fine. Zushin. See if I can actually keep the level 1 normal monster on the field for 10 turns and bust out Zushin. And hopefully I get hit with Utopia Lightning. Uh, Trimids. Okay, I'm fine with that. Cosmos. Sure. And uh, Prediction Princesses. So uh, there you go. So 30 decks, go ahead, go come over to this poll, vote for three, and we'll go ahead and see what's going to be on Daily Deals for next month. In tag, we have uh, Dark Magician, which uh, has been there for two months, so 
I really don't care. I mean, it's a fun deck. It's a fine deck. So if you guys want it for a third month, it would be kind of ridiculous. I don't think a deck has ever made it for three months just for the purpose of making it for three months. Sure. Uh, Resonators, that was a fine deck. If you guys want another month to die, I wouldn't mind that. Synchron, uh, I'd rather not. I'm not really a Synchro player, and Synchron's a very skilled deck. I feel like I'm going to fuck it up and get crucified, so I'd rather not. But if you guys want it, I'll fuck it up. So I'd rather not, but if you guys want... Uh, Metaphosis, sure, we can do that. Fuffles, I wouldn't mind that coming back. Necros for tag, okay. Infernoids, despite reason getting it on the one, it's not a dead deck. I can definitely do something with that. Uh, Shiranui, sure. Lightshorns, Satastic, sat Skillish Trash, sure. You know. Uh, Trap Tricks, back row and tag, I mean, we've been doing that more late lately, so I just pretty much have to uh, save your pack runner. I'm playing Trap Tricks from playing the back row, but, you know, bust out that Raffalasia and stuff like that in the actual deck, I guess. Uh, gimmick puppets. Um, maybe do something with seven sins. Uh, I, I could probably do something with that. Uh, Dragoonities. I mean, bust out a crystal meth with a vagina. Then that sounds pretty cool. Speedroids. Return of speedroids. Sure. You know, uh, when speedroids got taken off, they actually got some newer cards that I never got to try out. So uh, I wouldn't mind that. So uh, Tramids for tag. Uh, I'm not sure how that would work, but sure. You send you. I'm not sure how that would work in tag, but uh, okay. Zephyr Yangzing. Okay. I mean. Young Zing's not the best tag deck, but maybe with the enablers of Zephyrus and stuff and enabling my own plays and popping my own things, maybe? I don't know. Fire Kings, I mean, you know, not really taking my tag partner into consideration, but it, fuck them, right? So, Fire Kings, Lunalites, I still feel like this deck is really weak. I'd rather wait till this deck hopefully gets some more support before trying to play it again, but okay. Heroes, I mean, Dankwaldot deck, let's go. I mean, uh, Volcanics, more of a single deck, but alright. Uh, Girgia. With them assuming the new support, so okay. Gagaga. -ga -ga. I mean, Sanzi probably wouldn't like that, but we could do something with that. I could just be like, hey, Sanzi, send me the Gagaga -ga deck and I'll tweak it to my own liking, but yeah. Gem Knights. Yeah. Blue Eyes, the return of Blue Eyes. I believe Blue Eyes was a single and a tag and then tag again, I guess. Uh, ninjas. I personally don't think Ninjas that are that great, even with their new support, but okay. TG Stun. And tag? Come on. Come on, people. You're not thinking. Romages, that deck sucks. Like, there's no there's no debating. Romages suck, so, okay. Hey, at least I get to play Cheating Leaf. Because <laughs> I'll be healing my life points. Uh, you know, you, you really can't say anything. Black Wings, uh, you just did that to spite me. You know I don't like Black Wings, but I'll play it, but I don't like it. <laughs> uh, go, 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 Dodo Dodo Utopia. I'm assuming that's Omega Chaos, so, okay. And then Grave Keepers in tag. Just fuck my tag partner, like, ta sorry tag partner, unless you're playing, like, top tier shit, we're not winning shit, I'm playing goddamn Gravekeepers. So, uh, there you go, so, both, uh, there's tag, both polls are in the description, go ahead and click it, come over here, vote for two in tag, three in singles, and then I'll go ahead and, uh, take the polls down on Sunday and create all the thumbnails and the decks by then, uh, of course I'll be gone over the weekend, so... Uh, you know, I'll probably be working my ass off trying to get everything done for this upcoming week, doing deck profiles and, uh, adjusting, uh, things on Daily Duels, but don't, don't worry about that. So, uh, just go ahead and vote and pick whatever to your heart's content. Hopefully you pick something entertaining and hopefully I can provide some, uh, content for you guys. So, uh, thank you for taking the time to suggest decks and come over to the polls and vote. Thanks for watching and, uh, looking forward to seeing what you guys vote for.